Because you know I'm all about that bass, got that bass, no trouble. I'm all about that bass, got that bass, no trouble. I'm all about that bass, got that bass, no trouble. I'm all about that bass, got that bass. Yeah, it's pretty clear I ain't no size two, but I can shake it, shake it like I'm supposed to do. 'Cause I got that boom boom that all the boys chase and all the right junk in all the right places. I see the magazines, we're getting that Photoshop. We know that shit ain't real. Come on, I'll make it stop. If you got beauty, beauty, just raise 'em up. 'Cause every inch of you is perfect from the bottom to the top. Hey guys, I know it's a little late to do September favorites. It's hard to have a YouTube channel and a full-time job at the same time, but I'm gonna do it anyways because I'm just getting into this and I would really like to share what I liked in the month of September. So here we go. Without further ado, I've been really into Redken lately. I went in there because I straightened my hair a lot, so I really wanted something that would make my hair soft and allow me to straighten it without wrecking my hair too much. I really love this product. I don't know if you can see it with the glare, but it's Redken. I don't know if I'm pronouncing Redken right, but it's Smooth Lock Butter Silk Intensive Rinse Out Treatment for dry, unruly hair. And my hair is unruly. It's ridiculous. It's like from another planet. It's crazy hair. So yeah, um, I, I love this stuff. It's amazing and it smells like how you think butter silk would smell like. I don't, know, I don't know if that's a thing, but it smells amazing. And sticking with the hair trend, right now I've got Bedhead Rockaholic Dirty Secret Dry Shampoo. It's not usually pink, I think it's usually black, but Chatters was having a whole bunch of pink stuff because it's, well it was, Breast, can breast Cancer Month. And um, so they, I don't think it's usually in a pink container, but it's really great stuff. Uh, it smells amazing. I don't know, I go for anything that smells good. But not only does it smell good, but I, I think it legitimately does work. It doesn't make my hair feel greasy or extra dirty. So anyways, it's really great stuff if you're looking for like a lighter, a light kind of dry shampoo. I really suggest Bedhead. Um, it's probably cheaper at Walmart. I wouldn't get it at Chatters like I did, but... So I have mentioned before that I'm obsessed with hand creams. This stuff here, um, I decided to give Organics a try. And I absolutely love this whole line. I really want to get... I love this line. I really want to get uh, some shampoos and conditioners from this line. But this is the Hydrating Argon Oil of Morocco Lotion. And like I said, it's by Organics. I absolutely love it. Um, my hands get super, super dry here in Alberta in the winter times. Like super dry. Like they bleed. They get so dry. So this stuff is great so far. I don't know if I'll ever use the whole thing. Got some on my nose. This is my official scent slash body lotion of fall. It is the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Triple Moisture Body Cream by Bath & Body Works. This is literally like, I know I say this about everything, but like I could seriously just like, I could smell this forever. Like I, smell, I can just sit there and like watch a TV show and just be like, <laughs> my dad was like, he looked over and I was like just smelling my hand cream and he's like, and continuing on the trend of things that smell good, I've got a couple of sprays here. Actually, in September, I think I bought like five or six perfumes, like legit high-end perfumes. It's sad, I know. So I only picked two, and I picked a couple of sprays too, just because I couldn't resist. So my first one is called, it's by Bath & Body Works, and it's green. And it's called Pear & Cashmere Woods Autumn. It smells really, really amazing. I never smelled it before I got it. I got it online and I just, I couldn't resist. It just, it's, it looked like it smelled good. And this one here, a friend of mine got me into. She got it and I was like, WTF, what does that need to have? And it's, it's, it sounds ridiculous. <laughs> Body Fantasy's signature pink vanilla kiss fantasy that thing. <laughs> it's like My Little Pony in a bottle, but it's like $7. And it's just, it smells, like it just, it smells amazing. Like it's, for a $7 spray, it, you know, it's got little kissy marks all over. It's really awesome. For $7, I recommend it. And now for my two favorite perfumes of the month, I'm going to have to go with Jimmy Choo. 
I don't know which one this is by Jimmy Choo. I think there is a couple. It just says Jimmy Choo and I just it smells heavenly. I honestly I don't know like I like a lot of I either like clean scents or I like very candy type scents. This is in the middle. It's like candy but it's fresh. It's not too overwhelming. And then my second one was one that I didn't expect to discover. This was also in What's in My Purse because I have two of them. This is my full size, I think. It's called Vint de Sud. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. My French is not anything. <laughs> uh, by Lise Wadier. And like, this smells fresh. Like it's just like, like an ocean breeze or something. I don't know. It, it's really good. It's like 50 bucks too for like, I don't know, for like a medium. I think this was 50 bucks and it's it's very good for high-end perfume for the price. Okay, and on to makeup. I finally decided to give the Ben Nye Banana Powder a try and I do really like it. I kind of wish I had gotten the Cameo one, which I think I might get next, but I decided to add this in my favorites anyways because you know what, it is actually, it's a great product. Um, it's probably better for someone who has darker skin. I have very light skin. So I don't know, maybe it's, I just need to use a little less of it, but it is a good product. So I decided to put it in my favorites because I'm glad that I finally gave it a shot. And the nudes, Maybelline nudes, it's really good. I think it's like 11 or $12. It's, the swatches are pretty good. I'll give you a couple examples of a few of the swatches. So here's this. So I apologize for my dry hands. Also, my battery just died, so I don't know if this kind of looks like it doesn't match up to the last screen for lips. I was really excited when I saw these because up until now, my Shoppers Drug Mart hasn't really had any Soap and Glory products. So we got the two lip balms, and <laughs> I couldn't pick one. They're both equally amazing. One is peach. Bah! One is peach, and the other one is, well, it's called... Juicy Peach. <laughs> and this one is called Sweet Coconut. And it was cool. There's kind of like blue sparkles in it. I don't know if you can tell. I don't know. My camera is like in bad lighting. You can see the flash. Mm. Anyways. Um, they're both really great. They're just called Great Kisser. Great Kisser Lip Balm. And I love them. They're like $10 each. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous for a lip balm. But I couldn't help myself. And I should have mentioned this with hair, but I did recently do a kind of a haul at, well, not really, I didn't, I didn't film it, but I did a haul at Chatters. I really love going there. I was kind of upset at first because when I got this at first, I thought that it was like $7. And then I saw my receipt afterwards because I was wondering why it was so high. Didn't question it at the counter, I just questioned it afterwards. But it was like $18, okay? But seriously, but maybe it's because it's wooden. I don't know, but I, it's, and it's round. Like I have another teasing brush that's just like, it's just straight. But I have to admit, this does a really great job. Like it does a better job than my $4 one. So, you know, I'm not happy about the price, but the product is really great. It's a, it's a really good brush. <laughs> and my favorite song of the month was obviously played in the intro. Because you know I'm all about that bass. And to play my favorite song, I love my JBL clip. It is Bluetooth. You can hook it up to your iPod. There's a little extension in the back. <laughs> but this is awesome. I use it to clean my car. I just clip it somewhere. It's Bluetooth, wireless. I absolutely love it. It is great. I say absolutely and love a lot because I absolutely love a lot of things. And I really like slushies. So that is it for my favorites of September. I hope you enjoyed, I hope you enjoyed your stay. <laughs> no, I hope you enjoyed yourself. Really, I truly did. I know that I don't post very often. I plan on posting a lot more. It's a little hard, like I said, with a full-time job, but I'm gonna do it. This is really fun for me, and honestly, it's just, I really needed this. And can we just say for a moment that, is there any, like, plus-size beauty gurus on YouTube? I don't think so. But my plan is not to be a beauty guru. I do love makeup, but I love electronics. I love music. I love hand products. Like I just, <laughs> I have so many obsessions. And I just wanna say that basically on here, I just wanna have fun and do things that I love. And I kinda just started this 
channel because I was at a place where I just needed some fun and some inspiration in my life. And I know that this is kind of like a rambly thing to put in a favorites video, but I thought I would just put it out there because it was on my mind. So I'm just gonna stop this video before it becomes too mushy. No matter what, I'm just gonna do this for fun because it doesn't matter how many views I get, how many likes I get. It's just something that I've been wanting to do for a long time. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, like I said, for the millionth time. And have a great day.